so we'll start with unit 3 that is chopper or dc dc converter so what does dc to dc converter or chopper means like like name suggest uh, it is converting one side dc voltage to the other side dc voltage but the thing is the input side dc voltage is constant and we are getting the variable dc output so basically it is a uh, converting device where at one side we are getting the we are, we are feeding the constant dc and at the output side we are getting the variable dc it is equivalent to the uh, equivalent to ac transformer why we are comparing these things to the ac transformer because in ac what is happening the input power in transformer whatever input power we are get giving at the output same power we are getting so here also in in choppers uh, whatever input supply whatever input so input power we are giving for an ideal condition we will get the same amount of output power but condition is for the fixed dc we are getting the variable dc and this is our main focus because for the dc drives to control the speed of dc drives one of the major factor is the voltage variable voltage so with the variation of this voltage we can control the uh, speed of dc drive so th that is why it is important so the choppers can be characterized into two modes or two categories that is either it will be a step up chopper or step down chopper now if suppose v0 is the output and vs is the input so for step down this v0 is will be greater than the input output is greater than input for sorry for step up output is greater than input for step down the output average output voltage is less than the input supply so we'll study the step up chopper and step down chopper one by one so let's begin with the step down chopper so <clears throat> step down chopper like name suggest the output voltage is the average output voltage is less than the input voltage so here is the basic circuit diagram feeding the r load so this is the basic diagram of step down chopper where this is the thyristor control thyristor switch and for uh, for beginning we are taking r load and we'll, we'll let us see how how the output v not how how we are getting the output v not with the uh, with the this this switching sequence how we are getting the output voltage so 